Hi friends, my name is Ravi Krishnamurthy and I am part of a bulletier's group. We call ourselves the Three Gunners. Uh, there are two reasons why we have named our group uh, so. One is that it is based on the punchline Royal Enfield uses, made like a gun goes like a bullet. And the other is because we are three brothers. Uh, my brothers actually don't know that I'm making this video today. While I ride an Electra, my uh, brothers ride uh, the 500 standard. One has a black one, the other one has a forest green one. Why am I making this video today? Well, I just wanted to share with you the kind of modifications that I've done on my Electra. It has just completed a thousand kilometers. I personally feel the kind of Comfort that I'm getting after these modifications is very close to the comfort levels that one would get on uh, a Thunderbird. So um, here are some footages and some explanation about what I've done. I sure hope you like the video. If you do, please press the like button and uh, please do share your feedback. We hope that this is uh, you know the first of the many videos that we intend to bring your way. That's my Electra, uh, the maroon as they call it. Please notice the tank pads. I paid about 500 bucks for them. Uh, it looks good uh, in my opinion. I've changed the red tire also. Uh, it is the MRF one. I paid about 2200 bucks for it. Uh, it feels a lot solid and uh, I get a lot of grip on it. I went for the RD extended handlebar, uh, which is very, very comfortable. Here's a closer look of the uh, tank pad. Uh, they look gorgeous if you ask me. I paid about 500 bucks for them. And that is the crash guard that I went for paying 3,750 rupees with uh, the Royal Enfield branding. And that is the fog lamp that I went for paying about 1,300 bucks. Uh, they work pretty well. Again, uh, another look at uh, the tank pad from up close. If you see the height of uh, the Electra has uh, risen significantly and it's quite comfortable. There's another look of my bike from the other side. Notice the height including the mirrors. A close up view of the Avenger mirrors that I went for. I paid about 500 bucks for uh, this set. They vibrate a lot less and uh, show you a lot more what's behind you. That's the switch for uh, the fog lamps that I went for. Here's the real deal about the Avenger mirrors. Uh, I've set my camera for my eyesight level and I sit on the bike and the mirror actually shows a lot more what is behind you. It is quite easy to look into the mirrors as well. That's the grip I went for, 50 bucks. And that's another look of my uh, bike from up close. I couldn't change the levers. A top view of the tank and uh, the fog lamps. And that's just about it. Thank you for watching.